All right, what's up, y'all? Falcons fans. Um, let me level with y'all for a minute. Let, let me level with y'all for a minute. Um, there's something that I see a lot in our community as Falcons fans only that we need to stop. Um, it's going to lead to our just, it's going to lead to a lot of stress when the season starts. Um, and I see it a lot. So I'm going to try to at least stifle it around here and hopefully it spreads around the rest of the Falcons community or around all football communities. I, I think it's, I think it's stupid no matter who's the ones doing it. You know what I'm saying, um, I'm seeing a lot of Falcons people, a lot of Falcons fans arguing within each other. You know, you know how much sense, you know how much sense that doesn't make. We are we are Fal we are Falcons fans. You know, we all are Falcons fans, and we want the team to do well. But we're so wrapped up in us being on uh, one person being right or another person being right to where if the Falcons win a game, the first thing they would do is go to another Falcons creator and then try to. Um, Oh, I was right. See, like, like, I, I, look, I'm gonna tell you right now. I remember when the Falcons would one win. Like, I think they won the Raiders game. I have Falcons fans in my comments talk about, oh, I told you. I'm like, first of all, your first thing to think of as soon as the Falcons win a game, your first thing. You're not even going to the Raiders comments to, to comment at L or something. You're coming to another Falcons fan to laugh. At another Falcons fan, which is happy at the same time as you are, because because the team that you're both like won, you like <laughs> y'all y'all saw I had someone another Falcons uh, creator um, make a video responding to my video, and I was like I'm not responding back to this because one of first of all it's it's pointless, you know what I'm saying it's just a back and forth argument, and second of all we both want the same thing. Obviously, we all have different opinions on how we think the team can improve. Me and my boy Sports Live and ATL, we have two differentiating, different, I can't even say that word, differentiating opinions. But there's going to be no point in time. I trust him. I trust myself. And there's going to be no point in time where I go on his channel and just start cussing him out because he thinks Matt Ryan is supposed to be there. Cool. He knows I don't. <laughs> he, know, he knows how I feel about it, but I'm never going to go over him and cuss him out. And, and as soon as the Falcons win, hey, didn't I tell no i'm gonna say it on the video i'm gonna yell at y'all in the video i i promise i will but i'm not gonna go to another person's channel with no reason and then just try to make them mad now don't get it confused if there's a game comes on and matt ryan throws five interceptions trust me that will be the point of my video i'm not gonna lie to you but there will be never a point in time where i go to another falcons creator go in their comments or make a whole video surrounded around them and say oh you were wrong it doesn't make any sense. If you if you have an opinion so much, if, if your opinion is that big, go on your platform, say your opinion, upload the video. That's it. You know? There should be no point in time where as, us as Falcons fans, like, think, think of this. Think of all the Falcons fans were together in one room. The Falcons win a Super Bowl. You know how that crazy that sounds. The Falcons win a Super Bowl. Okay. Instead of celebrating, oh, hugging each other, oh, yeah, yeah, but the first thing they decide to do is just start fighting each other. They just start fighting in there. Oh, I told you Matt Ryan was good. Oh, you know how stupid that looks? Can you imagine that? Your team won the championship, and the first thing y'all do is want to fight within each other. What Y'all did it. You won. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't understand where my team would win, and I'm angry, you know? <laughs> like, I remember when... I think the Falcons, it was like the second or third game they won. And I wasn't like all celebratory because we, we were definitely out of the playoffs at that time. But I, there was no point in time where I would be just like mad that they won. Of course, I'd be like, oh, now you won. You know what I'm saying? But there's no point in time where I was getting, I'm, I'm mad they got a victory. Like that, that doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. I'm never going to go to another Falcons creator and, and, and try to make them mad when my team, our team, just won a game. That is stupid. That's stupid. That's very stupid. There's going to be no point in time where I do that. People have done it to me. It's whatever, you know. I, it's, it's what I signed up for. I, I could care less, really. But as, as for me, and I think all Falcons, all football creators, if you're a Colts fan, there's no reason why you're arguing with another Colts fan in the house. Like, that doesn't make any sense. 
You guys both want the Colts to win. So why are you arguing? Why are you mad at each other? That doesn't make that. Like, there's mad Saints fans. Go argue with the Saints fan. Don't argue with the Falcons fan that's on the same wavelength as you. What? Come on, man. Y'all got, got to tighten up with that, man. And I see it a lot. I know there's some Falcons, I know there's some Falcons uh, creators that I don't see, but the, the Falcons creators that I do watch, I go in the comments, and it's just two Falcons fans arguing about who's right, about how the team should be better. Shut up. <laughs> like, both of y'all want the team to be good. Both of y'all can have your opinions and then go your separate ways. There's no reason for y'all to be having a 40-minute argument about who you think should stay on the team when both of y'all have the same goal. Both of y'all have the same goal of the Falcons winning a ring. If that, if y'all share that common knowledge, there should be no argument there. There's going to be different, differentiating opinions on how you get to that point. But it shouldn't be a 40-minute argument. It shouldn't be a, a more than five-minute discussion, honestly. I don't think so. Unless it's a, a constructed response or constructed um, discussion, like on like on a platform, like on a podcast or something, then you guys could go back and forth like that. But y'all in the comments, y'all just making videos, and I, I, I I've seen it so much, and like there would be one big creator, another small creator. And he's like, oh, I got more subscribers than you, so I'm right. You gotta think about it. I, I put everyone on the same level as far as the YouTuber thing goes. If you pick up a, a camera and you upload a video on YouTube, which already takes enough out of you as far as mental health, um, how much how much security you have on the camera, putting your video out for the whole world to see, if you are enough to do that, I call you a YouTuber. I don't care if you got four subscribers or about halfway to 3,000 like I am. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I've never been scared to just go for anybody who was... Um, Millions of subscribers past me. Creators creating their opinions, making videos, making people laugh. That's all I do. That's all I try to do. I know I'm in distress in those videos when the Falcons lose, but y'all find entertainment, so I'm never gonna stop. You know. So it's just like that's just always been my thing. I I found myself doing it in the past, so I'm saying it as far as like now going on. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try my best not to do that kind of stuff because it seems like. It seems pointless. You're talking to a wall. You got two people that want the same thing, but y'all arguing. What y'all arguing about? Who's right? Okay, one can be right. If it leads to a championship, then both y'all gonna be happy. I would hope. I would hope so. But I don't know how many. I, I, I guess it's just the anger of us being in the predicament that we're in as far as of how bad our team is. It just leads to a whole bunch of tension, and I'm right and all this stuff. I guess, but I, I've never thought to just attack another Falcons creator because I was right about something. I I, I can't. I, I'm. It does, it doesn't make much sense to me, is what I'm saying. But that's all I gotta say, man. Um, if you guys like this video, like the video, subscribe if you're new, subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below. Could have gonna be through next, man. Stay safe, drink water. I love you guys, and I will see y'all in the next video, man.